Hi, I'm Kylie Miller, former Young Chef of the Year. Being stuck at home isn't something that we particularly enjoy, but you know what? We're in this together. Something that I've found that makes my days a lot more enjoyable is cooking at home. And what better time than now with all this time on our hands to get into the kitchen. I'm going to share with you a recipe that's inspired by a farm to table restaurant I worked in and also with all this amazing produce we can get from our Aussie farmers, a seasonal vegetable tart. First step for the tart is to heat up the oven. Heat it up to 180 degrees Celsius. The next thing we're going to do is start to build the pastry case. Onto a piece of baking paper, spray a little bit of olive oil and then start to layer the pastry. Once you've got six or eight layers of the phyllo pastry done, we're going to give it a final spray and then create a little border before putting it into our uh, baking tray. Next thing we're going to do is roast off some vegetables. I've already got them cut, we're just going to pop them into a baking tray. I'm using some sweet potatoes, some eggplant, zucchini, beans and some spring onion. But you can use whatever you've got at home. Whatever's in season or whatever you've got a little bit extra of that you need to use up from your fridge. It's going to put a little bit of olive oil over the top and then a little bit of salt before it goes into the oven with the pastry case for about 15 to 20 minutes or until the veggies are tender and the pastry case is nice and golden brown. Once everything's baked off, we're going to assemble the tart. First thing, we're going to put a little bit of seeded mustard on the base and then putting all the veggies on top as well. And just scattering it around, making sure it's even, evenly spread. And then just before we put it back into the oven, I'm going to create a few little divots inside of the vegetables and pop some eggs in there. So I've just finished baking the tart. I'm going to take it out of the baking tray and pop it onto my serving tray. Just gently slide it off. And then we're going to finish it with a few little garnishes. I've got some roasted nuts, a little bit of sour cream, maybe a bit of lemon zest and some fresh herbs to finish as well. And that's how you make my seasonal vegetable tart. For this recipe and for more what's for dinner recipes, head to coles.com.au.